How Andrew Tate Got Rich the story of how one becomes wealthy is often a tapestry woven of ingenuity, hard work, risk-taking, and sometimes a bit of serendipity. In the case of Andrew Tate, the narrative begins with kicks and punches, moves to the glitzy world of webcams, and ultimately shines a light on the nuances of gender dynamics when it comes to money. But how did he go from being a world champion kickboxer with limited financial returns to a savvy entrepreneur with a thriving business model? A kickstarting career with limited financial gains. When we think of world champions, we often envision a glamorous life filled with fame and opulence. However, in the realm of kickboxing, even a title as prestigious as world champion doesn't necessarily mean one is making money hand over fist. Such was the case for Andrew Tate. While he achieved an outstanding level of success in the ring, it didn't exactly translate to a vast fortune. This discrepancy between achievement and financial reward set the stage for his pursuit of a more lucrative venture. Andrew Tate's rise to become a world champion in kickboxing was an embodiment of grit, discipline, and sheer determination. Each match, each move was a testament to years of rigorous training and an indomitable spirit. However, despite the thunderous applause, the glistening sweat, and the shiny belts, the remuneration he received was often in stark contrast to his efforts. This realization drove Andrew to explore other avenues, searching for a career that would not only satiate his ambitions, but also offer financial returns worthy of his dedication. A Deep Dive Into The World Of Money The quest for a sustainable and profitable career prompted Andrew to immerse himself in the intricate world of finance. What he found was a system riddled with imperfections, full of pitfalls and limitations. Money wasn't merely a tool of exchange, but rather a complex entity that required a keen understanding and strategic navigation. As Andrew delved deeper into the realm of finance, he encountered various concepts, theories, and practices that challenged conventional wisdom. This journey made him acutely aware of the potential pitfalls that lay in the path of those seeking to amass wealth. These revelations solidified his belief in the importance of financial literacy understanding that it wasn't just about earning money, but managing, investing, and multiplying it smartly. The strip club venture, a costly proposition. Ever the opportunist, Andrew considered diving into the nightlife business, specifically the idea of opening a strip club. He had the connections, particularly with his girlfriends, and thought it might be a golden opportunity. However, Upon deeper exploration, he found that the overhead costs and complexities involved in such a venture would be prohibitive. While the allure of neon lights and pulsating music might have been captivating, the world of strip clubs was riddled with challenges. From stringent regulations to the unpredictability of clientele, the industry was not for the faint-hearted. Andrew's pragmatic approach meant he was quick to identify the potential roadblocks and weigh them against the projected returns. Though his enthusiasm was palpable, the scales of feasibility tipped away from this venture. A new digital dawn, the webcam industry. Just as one door seemed to be closing, another swung wide open. In the digital age, the webcam industry emerged as a burgeoning market. The idea was simple yet profound. Women could interact with users online, offering various forms of entertainment in exchange for payment. Andrew recognized that he already had a network of attractive and charismatic women who could potentially thrive in this environment. The allure of the webcam industry wasn't just in its profitability, but also in its adaptability. With the world moving increasingly online, the demand for digital entertainment options surged. Andrew observed the patterns, recognizing the boundaries of traditional entertainment were shifting. This sector not only offered an innovative platform, but also a unique blend of personal connection and digital interaction precisely what the audience of the new age yearned for. Building the empire beyond just good looks. Creating a successful webcam business wasn't merely about having beautiful women on camera. It was about smart, charming, and entertaining women who could effectively engage with customers. Andrew knew he had to play to his strengths. He would manage the technicalities and infrastructure, and perhaps more critically, motivate and train the women to ensure optimal performances. Andrew's vision for his webcam business was holistic. He wanted to create an environment where the women felt empowered, valued, and in control of their narrative. While their beauty was evident, he emphasized harnessing their intellect, wit, and charm. By fostering a culture of continuous learning and improvement, 
he ensured that every interaction on this platform was of the highest caliber, further cementing the loyalty of his customer base. Recruitment and Expansion Using his personal connections, Andrew began recruiting. Whether they were girlfriends or new acquaintances, he saw potential in the women around him. Under his guidance, these women would become the pillars of his webcam empire. As the business blossomed, so did the need for expansion. Andrew's operation grew, encompassing multiple locations and a growing roster of webcam artists. Each woman Andrew recruited was a unique asset to his growing empire. He identified and nurtured their strengths, allowing them to carve out niches for themselves. This personalized approach translated into a diverse range of offerings for his customers, ensuring that there was something for everyone. As the word spread and demand increased, Andrew's infrastructure grew organically, adapting to the evolving needs of both the artists and the clientele. The Nuts and Bolts of the Webcam Business Managing a successful webcam empire is no walk in the park. The logistics involved were intricate. Andrew had to rent houses, outfit them with the necessary technology, and carefully orchestrate the schedules of the numerous women involved. Moreover, he provided them with the flexibility to choose how they wished to engage with customers. Some might simply talk, some might choose to work fully clothed, while others might opt for more revealing performances. This variety was crucial in catering to a broad spectrum of customer preferences. Efficiency was paramount in Andrew's operations. He understood the importance of a seamless technical experience to complement the talents of his artists. Investments in state-of-the-art technology, continuous training sessions, and a responsive support system became the backbone of his business. This emphasis on quality over quantity allowed his platform to stand out and deceive competitors, creating a unique brand identity. The business model, a fair exchange. The revenue model for Andrew's business was relatively straightforward. In return for providing the support, infrastructure, and organization necessary for the webcam artists to perform, he would take a cut of their earnings. This amounted to roughly 50%, a testament to the value he added through his management and technical expertise. Andrew's transparent approach to revenue sharing showcased his commitment to fairness and mutual growth. By providing the resources, tools, and environment for the webcam artists to thrive, he was ensuring the long-term sustainability of his business. This symbiotic relationship meant that as the artists achieved success, so did Andrew's enterprise, creating a win-win solution that was both equitable and prosperous. Understanding Gender Dynamics in Finance Beyond the realm of kickboxing and webcams, Andrew often mused on the differences in financial perspectives and behaviors between men and women. These reflections were not just idle thoughts, but pivotal in shaping his business approach. Understanding these dynamics, he could better tailor his business strategy, ensuring the success of his venture. Through his various ventures, Andrew witnessed firsthand the diverse ways men and women approached financial decisions. He observed that while men were often driven by competition and status, women prioritized stability and long-term security. These insights were invaluable in shaping his business strategies. By tailoring his approaches to cater to these distinct motivations, Andrew was able to foster an environment that recognized, respected, and rewarded the unique perspectives and contributions of both genders. Evolving with the Digital Age In an era where technology was advancing at an unprecedented pace, Andrew Tate proved to be a visionary, always a step ahead of the curve. As the digital world expanded, so did the myriad of opportunities within it. The webcam industry, while a goldmine, was merely one facet of the vast digital realm. Andrew recognized the importance of continuously adapting, evolving, and embracing new technologies to stay relevant and ahead in the game. The digital age was not just about having an online presence. It was about integrating technology into every aspect of the business. From leveraging data analytics to understanding customer preferences better, to adopting artificial intelligence for more personalized user experiences, Andrew continually sought ways to innovate. This forward-thinking approach wasn't just about maximizing profits, it was about future-proofing his enterprise. By always keeping an ear to the ground and an eye on emerging trends, Andrew ensured that his business would not just survive the tidal waves of technological change, but ride them to new heights of success. Andrew Tate's journey to wealth is a testament to adaptability, vision, and understanding market dynamics. From the rigorous world of kickboxing to the glitzy and digital domains of webcams, Andrew showcased an ability to evolve and capitalize on opportunities. 
This story serves as an inspiring example on how relentless curiosity, combined with a willingness to learn and adapt, can pave the way to financial success.